Hey, it's Clay, and this will be a video chart on ticker symbol OGEN. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. Not sure what I mean by 30 minute. I do offer an explanation video at that link. Did this analysis recently, so that is where the red and green line annotations are coming from. But after today's price movement, gonna do a little house cleaning here and get rid of these lines. Sure, those levels still pertain, they're just not relevant right now. And from a presentation standpoint, I don't wanna risk causing clutter and confusion because there's lines all over the place. So let's try to keep this analysis as clean as possible going forward. The first update that needs to be made though comes about based on a foundational rule in charting, which states, when levels of resistance are broken and closed above, you wanna see them act as support, and that is exactly what played out here today. So I mean, you could throw this right into a textbook if you wanted to, I mean, a great example. So for those of you that did watch the previous video, I talked about that 75-ish cents as an area of resistance, but you can see this morning, the price did break above it. And then, middle of the afternoon, price pulled back, and I mean, you just can't make this stuff up. Price literally bounced right off that level going forward. So point here being 75 cents is gonna be that ideal level of support going forward. Ideal meaning, you know, hey Clay, what make this chart look the best? Certainly if the price can stay above 75 cents. With that being said though, it's not like if the price falls below 75, then that implies the entire chart's destroyed or ruined or anything like that. But yeah, if the price could stay above 75, that would certainly be a great sign of power moving forward. Taking a step back and looking at all this from the bigger picture point of view, that is where the purple line there comes into play, the 50 period simple moving average, keyword being moving. So as time goes by, that line is gonna move itself higher and higher. So a very straightforward way to gauge the health of the move, that right there being defined as the move, just watch that purple line. As long as the price stays above that line, as the line itself moves higher and higher, then the bulls are in full health, the bulls are in full control. How you can best visualize that, that is what has been represented. Again, yeah, staying above, that level right there would be great, but from the grand scheme of it all, as long as the price is above the purple line, the bulls 100% own the chart. As far as areas of resistance are concerned, they don't matter. What do I mean? Well, it matters the most is what the price has already been doing. And that's right there, just building those higher lows or if you want to envision these as stair steps. So as long as the stair steps continue to be constructed in the upward direction, then given enough time, everything else will eventually take care of itself, including breaking areas of resistance. But all in all, very nice movement today. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too good, way too, good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.